the final step, the infusion of energy. What's the crack again there, YouTube? Your good friend Dasmer coming at you with a little more NCAA 12 gameplay. So by this time we were, well, we were, I was really hoping to have some of the three-way rivalry gameplay. Unfortunately, our good friends at EA, yes, there is a very big flaw right now where if you try to create an online dynasty with um, created teams, it's when you do send out the invites, the two, three, or one, or whatever people you're inviting, when they accept the invite, it literally locks up your Xbox. Yay, EA, and they're beta testing. Woohoo! So, in the interim, we've set up this one. I'm the Irish. Uh, Jimmy's picked his orange with Tennessee, and Herman <laughs> and has picked his Michigan Wolverines. <laughs> hate them. Respect the program, but hate the team. You know what I mean? Um, we haven't gotten very far into that. Uh, that uh, what we in our third game of that se of of that. So. You know, it is what it is. Uh, we're hoping that they can fix it. Uh, Passion didn't come out today. Thursday's another one. We'll see by the end of next week. And if not, we're going to have to get that one rolling. And we'll have to roll with that. And apologies to everybody. But the in the interim, what I have been doing it is I've got an offline dynasty going on. I'm playing with my battle and bishops. And to let you know, too, uh, this is what our third season. Or this is our third season. This is my third season uh, already. And what we did, if you, if you haven't been following, is... Um, so we created teams, we took the Cupcake uh, roster template, uh, two-star prestige program, and uh, we all agreed on that you could do a couple of edits. Um, you could edit uh, one player to a senior of a 90 overall, two players to a junior of 85 overall, and two freshmen to a 78 overall. So uh, my senior was a center, long gone. My two juniors, I picked uh, the two corners, they just left, and the two freshmen are still playing. They're now juniors here. Uh, you can see in this gameplay, my quarterback, Horatio Strake. <laughs> and uh, my left tackle there, um, uh, Mr. Newsom, uh, the, all in their junior season. So that's what's been going on. I wanted to bring you a little bit of gameplay at least, uh, bring you some thoughts on, you know, after a week of gameplay. Like I said, I'm in the third season of this already, of uh, Offline Dynasty, so I've... And, you know, we've played a couple of games. I've played some games online, too, against a couple of randomers. And um, my friends, man, me and uh, me and Jimmy B had a killer game last night. Army and Navy. Uh, it's just two seasons in a row. Army and Navy seems to be this great matchup between us. I don't, I don't know what it is. What we end up with uh, um, a classic matchup score, like 1,400 and something. <laughs> Jimmy ended up coming back on me, scoring like two, two unanswered touchdowns and what like the last three minutes of the game was brutal and ended up winning so anyways uh let you know uh this is uh me against mississippi state this is my first real challenge of the season was this like the third game of the season if i remember correctly and my first real challenge the first two what i played middle tennessee state and somebody else uh, i just you know bitch slapped around um and this was the first real challenge and also you know my schedule starts to ramp up a little bit here and I've got this one, and uh, next up after this will be BYU, um, and that's my last uh, non-conference game. And then the, my first conference game, fun, was against Virginia Tech. But uh, to let you know my thoughts so far on this, well, I'll let you know about this game. This game was brutal, man, just brutal. Like, I, I was literally living in fear every time I threw the ball downfield. And I think I ended up chucking up five interceptions in this game. There was like eight total turnovers in this game, six of which were mine. What I had five picks and a fumble, <laughs> and somehow I still end up pulling out the victory. You know, I've got this really lowly rated defense, but there were mostly uh, mostly freshman recruits and uh, a few of the decent guys that were left on my team. Uh, yeah, yeah, Melvin Jenkins gets player of the game with a tackle. <laughs> it tells you how brutal that game was, man. <laughs> yeah, next up here's BYU. BYU game here is not going to be very long. No offense to any BYU fans out there, but uh, I end up kicking the crap out of them. So, um, yeah, that's what's going on. So, my thoughts after, you know, you, know, you saw my reaction if you've been following my vids. And if you haven't been following my vids, why not, man? Uh, if you saw, you know, you know what? I was stoked for this release. Uh, you know, a lot of things look promising about this. Uh, if you're follow, you know, and I follow what's going on in the background, people were saying some pretty positive things about. Well, you know what, it you got to kind of temper it because it is EA Sports, and they do uh, they do kind of uh, 
But they do a good job on the marketing, man. You gotta give them that. Uh, hey, oh, check this play out here. Uh, oh no, it's not this one. Uh, it's the next touchdown I think I score. Uh, my quarterback does a little scamper and he ends up getting a mild concussion, gets knocked out for the rest of the game. Uh, by that time, it's you know it doesn't matter. It's way over, as you can see by the score here. My, it's my freshman quarterback who plays the second half, and I don't really do anything. Not much happens, anyways. You'll see in the final score. So getting back to final uh, to thoughts after a week of gameplay, uh, the game's the game's good and bad. Is really the only way to go. To, it's a fun PvP game. Player, if you play player versus player, this is this is gonna be a fun game, man. Because the you know the work that they put in this season uh, to finally try to straighten it out. You know, it's made it fun. It's made it less bullshitty, which is awfully nice. Um, myself, I don't really play against the general public online since 2006 uh, across PlayStation 2, PC, Xbox, Xbox 360, PlayStation th and PlayStation 3, um, and PC again in there. Uh, I just find it's, you know, it's about who's got the bigger, you know, whose rat will beat whose cheese, you know, and I, I don't, I just prefer not to play that way, man. You know that's not the way I. That's not the way you, your good friend Dasmer games. You know I'm a straight up player. Play the game. Let the chips fall where they may. You know I'll, you know I'll I'll play call most people out there just because I've been playing these games since like they came out, man. So it's just a, you know that's a big thing. It's such just uh, the controls and getting to know the game myself. I don't think it's that big of a challenge. It's just situational awareness more than anything else. Um, and here's the Virginia Tech game. So this is my first conference game. As you can see, uh, I, I come into this four and, or no five and zero, oh, and Virginia Tech's five and zero. Oh, and uh, yeah, we're both ranked, and uh, Virginia Tech's ranked much higher than me. So yeah, man, we end up uh, pulling her out. Uh, so again, just some final thoughts. You know. It's a fun PvP game, but there are just so many errors in this game. Little errors and a couple big ones. Like I said, the online dynasty with created teams freezes your Xbox. I found two other points in this game that will literally freeze your Xbox. If you're doing the offline dynasty, by the way, second season, make sure you accept all your transfer requests. Or else it'll lock up your Xbox. Just cut them when you get in the, into the off-season mode there. That was really dumb. Uh, what I tried to do, uh, change my... Uh, I'm running a custom playbook. I tried to edit my, uh, what do you call it there, um, audibles. That froze my Xbox when I tried to do that. You know, that kind of stuff. And, you know, the little audio errors, the statistical errors, a couple of rules errors. You know, it's death, death by a thousand cuts with this game, man. And that's something that uh, EA's really got to get a pick up on is they got to get back on the quality control, man. The quality control for this product was uh, it's pretty abysmal is the only way that I could put it. Um, and pretty atrocious for 2011 to have you know features, you know game features locking up your your system. But it's a fun PvP game. I give it about a 69, 70 out of 100. Um, really looking forward to hopefully get our uh, custom uh, franchise dynasty thing going there. And check it later there, YouTube.